a ton of requests for this topic. Ooh. And from what is speaking it? from personal experience, is the suspense killing you? Is it killing you? What is, is it? it? What is it? Arranged marriage. Uh, oh. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, wah, wah. The dreaded two words that no Indian girl wants to hear. Not, I mean, okay, not none. I don't think any woman. <laughs> it's a huge concern at this point and it's anxiety and it's pretty much for any young adult in the family, male mm. or female. So girls, mm -hmm. coming from immigrant parents who are all, we all had arranged, mar uh, arranged uh, we parents did it. We did it. who were <laughs> of arranged marriages. Yes. Do you think that it's, it's norm? Do you think that it can work? Um, I think in this society, I, I know people who are still getting arranged marriages mm -hmm. and they are very happy in their marriage. Um, but me personally, I would not want to get an arranged marriage. But you've seen so many success stories. I have seen success stories, but as a person, I need to feel, I need to like have a connection before I have. Mm. See, there's a difference here. Yeah. Yeah. I think that nowadays it's more arranged dating. Saying that like these days, um, like at least Desi parents, they're more likely mm -hmm. to set you up on an arranged date. At least in the US. I don't know how the arranged marriages in India are. They still are. happen, yeah. And if they're, you know, you wake up well, one day, you got a ring Well, I think people like think of arranged marriage and they think of like a young woman marrying an older Yeah, but man. that's not always and, true. You know, yeah. clearly our parents, none of them are divorced. So no. clearly that's Do you something, think, right? But I mean, I, I got to say that That's also the generation not, that they were in. That's true. Divorce was not common. In yeah, the divorce wasn't something that someone even thought about. In the US, US even marriage about. rates are like mm -hmm. under 50. Do you yeah. think back when our parents were younger, they had three glamorous, amazing <laughs> women talking about this on TV? No. no. <laughs> N-A-W. So, <laughs> I mean, Do you, speaking from experience, yeah. my brother had an arranged marriage, um, you okay. know, through the whole website and everything. but. Oh, it turned out to be shadi.com. Yeah, shadi. He was on everything. <laughs> Double matrimony, like anything. My mom was like, boom, boom. That was her personal Facebook. She was oh. like, I don't know why this DJ, <laughs> but she would scroll and she would try to find like the perfect person to fit into our family and to have like two families merge together okay. versus just my brother marrying um, someone else. And he ended up finding someone who was really great, and we love That's it. So nice. But yeah. even with that success story, I don't know if I. Um, would completely agree because I do want to fall in love. Is yeah. that weird? Is no, that a weird thing not. to know? Yeah. To, I think every girl has this like fantasy or like fairy tale of finding her match made in heaven. Yeah. But yeah. I don't think you can't find that in an arranged marriage. I don't think like so. Like you either. said, your um, brother got one and is he in a yeah, very he's, happy marriage? They're, but the thing is, they're learning to, like, they love each other from the moment. I, I think you can I don't think it was fall in love, in love with your spouse. Over time, mm. yeah, yes, over can. time. You spend, you know, you're spending six, the next sixty years with this person. But to be honest, like I want to focus a little bit more on my career, yeah. and mm -hmm. I think it's the forcefulness of like you need to find someone. You're not going to be able to take care of yourself. Um, the, those kind of comments, mm -hmm. those, it's very anti-feminist. And for Abs me yeah. to be told that I need a husband to take care of me, mm -hmm. uh -huh. that's the part that I don't really. Right. Because I, I feel like arranged that. marriage is like connotated to women can't do anything. Yeah. And you have no right. Right. And you're going to be married to someone, and you're going to be a housewife. And yeah, it's like more about the children. At that well, point. the concept does come from the fact that one person does not necessarily have a say and it's other people that have a say for them. So mm -hmm. the thought behind it of the woman not having any power is not necessarily true, but the concept is that's where it brews from. But yeah. interestingly enough, I did want to mention that according to statistics mm -hmm. from UNICEF and the Human Rights Council, the average global divorce rate for an arranged marriage couple is only 4%. 4%. Mm. And keep in mind that love marriage versus um, arranged marriage is exact 50-50. 50% <laughs> of this planet still gets to arranged marriage. 50% of this planet gets a love marriage. Anyways, yeah, it's not only just an Indian culture. It's not. It's that's well, that's definitely Asian. a stigma. Can I also say that that could be that it's only 4% because in the Indian culture, your divorce not is not to. allowed. I mean, I mean, not just allowed. Indian culture. Or I think my culture, you're not supposed to be divorced or I get mean, a divorce. Yeah. It's just, it's, it's, I think it's a people thing. This it is, is not an and Indian versus arranged versus love. It's like, what kind of people do you want in your life? Right. And I think the younger generation is more heading to, or heading towards making their own choices about their own marriage and yeah, their yeah. own life. Whether so it's arranged or not. So. that it works out for them and us. Yeah. But what works out and for us. this awkward conversation <laughs> is that it's time to go on a quick break. Break time. Since 
it's nine. It started in 1960 when high fructose corn syrup was just introduced into the market, and uh -huh. now every single food has that in it. Oh, so okay. you're saying the FDA has like this? Their secret. They're trying to make us all fat. <laughs> they don't want us. 